Hello everybody, this is Bones. We are going to be doing a game uh, called Orc Island. Um, and as the name says, for once, there are no zombies in this survival game, so I immediately really like that. Um, because frankly, I I'm really sick of zombies and survival horror. And just survival games. Um, good lord. Uh, I'm kind of sick of zombies in general. Um, I mean, what happened to good monster movies, you know? Did we get, like, another creature from the Black Lagoon? Something else here? Anyways, I am left-clicking here to grab as much stuff as I can. Uh, this is Orc Island. Uh, this game is very affordable. I will have a link to it down in, uh, as always, with our games. We will have a little link for you. So you guys can, if you like it, in the description, pick it up. Um, we do apologize that we hadn't done any other Let's Plays for the holidays, but we are making up for that right now. Um, like crazy. So right now I'm grabbing everything I can. Now one neat feature of this game is that you are given a little helper uh, named a Gronk, who is sort of like this rock, rock man. Um, and as Orc Island sounds, there are orcs on the island. So they are your enemies instead of zombies or, uh, you know, um, one thing I have to say right off the bat is there are a lot of features in this game. Uh, this is a very ambitious game with a lot you can do from farming, um, fishing, which I love in survival games, so that immediately won me over. You can collect minerals, like so you can see I'm getting copper here. Uh, you can get a lot of different stuff, build a lot of different stuff. Um, and I was very happy with the fact that you can even, um, if you notice, the ground is dynamic. Um, even more so uh, than Minecraft, which generally is just straight blocks. This one has angles, so things can be angular. Um, I believe he, this here is our Gronk. Uh, as he is named. Uh, Gronk is a happy little fellow. Um, who hates uh, chickens as much as you will. Uh, I've done a little testing, a little time to adjust. Um, this game, uh, at first, you're going to want to play around a few times. Hello there, Gronk. So there is Gronk. Um, Gronk has no use for me yet, but I've woken him up. As you can see, he's kind of this little dude who will follow me for now, which is cool. Um, once we feed him some soup, then he will definitely start paying attention. He's a lot like me. I'm more agreeable with food in me. So, you know, it's an island. Gronk's just trying to make a living. He's doing what a Gronk does. Um, now, there are crops and things to do with crops. Um, when you put them down, chickens will rush up and try to mess with your crap, so I try not to do that right off the bat. Instead, what I have taken to doing here is running around the island a little, collecting random things. Um, but they do have, uh, the creator has made a really easy sort of way to help you out right off the bat, and that is that one of the minerals in this game can be used to convert into other minerals, and it's Every game has something like that, that is the end-all, be-all building material. They use gold in this. Um, I don't have a problem with it because you can do a lot in this game. Uh, like I said, the first time I played it, I went and did a single blind uh, playthrough. So this isn't quite a blind playthrough, but this is my first real playthrough of this. So you guys are seeing my first real effort in playing this game and trying to actually survive instead of just kind of explore. Um, really dig the effort put into it. Uh, I mean, again, I've never played another survival game where you have a little helper like Gronk here that just kind of follows you around and all that. It's neat. Um, instantly. It is a single player, which is nice because, no offense, uh, I started off with uh, 
Well, it didn't start off, but I, I was in on the whole Rust craze, like everybody else. I was sold on that one a little too easy, and then realized very quickly that every server was full of just 12 year old douchebags who were trying to ruin your day. And it, uh, you know, if you have a real life, if you have other stuff to do in your day, then it's kind of a waste of your time. So, alright, first things first here. Uh, you press one, we're gonna do a little farming. Um, I think this is a, a nice ground here, so we're gonna go through. Oh, shoot, I did that wrong. Okay, that's I'm sorry. So we're gonna right click the ground until it looks all extra fertilizing. And uh, what that does, you keep clicking it here, guys, and you will notice that the ground becomes uh, very potent. For farming, so we are going to get some crops going and uh, keep the chickens away from them until the first set of crops is done. Um, and then afterwards, I will try to uh, see if I can't build some other things when I'm doing this. I think I can actually, like I said, you can use the gold to build other things. So we're going to do that. We have tomato. I am Italian, I like tomatoes, so maybe Gronk will like tomatoes too. If not, tough, because that's what Gronk is getting. Alright, my bad. There's a crop there, so let's get some corn. And we'll do a little, little bit of each. I don't want to build too big right now and have Gronk is like feed me. Um, so we're going to do that while we're doing that. Um, you can see here, you can do things with wood, you can do things with stone, you can make tiles, so I mean, you can really let your imagination go a little crazy here with this stuff, which is cool. Um, there's a cooking pot here, um, and I want some bedrock and iron. Now, I believe first I'm going to want uh, some stuff here. I need some dead trees. I do not have any dead trees. You <gasps> see that chicken there? Look at him. Look at that little bastard. Messing with that right there. So, uh, yeah, those chickens, they gotta go. So that is going to be the first thing that I set up Grunk to do, is be my, uh, creator. Now, I told you before, you can use make. And I have collected four gold. God, I really gotta quit. Uh, doing the clicking the way I was doing there. Left click grabs, right click sets down. The easiest can be, and I keep having the problem remembering it. Uh, so we're going to give this crap a little more time. You better get away, chickens. You can get feathers from the chickens, by the way, if you sock them one. Um, along with just a sick delight of knocking the shit out of a chicken that keeps trying to steal your food, which I'm all about. You're a little bastard to keep trying to steal my food. See, look at, look at. I thought I wasn't coming back. You were wrong. Uh, again, you were watching Orc Island, for those of you, uh, curious. Uh, this developer has obviously put quite a bit of work into this. Um, and I feel like this is one of those games that, I mean, I could do, I don't even know, but I feel like no matter how long the Let's Play of this is, I'm not really even going to scratch the surface. Uh, I can see that if you love building, you're going to really dig this game because you can do things, I think, uh, as far as building like palaces, big things. I grabbed a little more out of the crap. We're going to find some dead trees. We need some dead trees here and some more gold so we can do some extra stuff um, and get fire built fire, you can get iron made from the gold, and then you go to a fire pit. From the fire pit uh, comes soup, which is very good. The Gronk soup, and Gronk will uh, actually do things for you, like guard. Uh, you can have Gronk harvest, so Gronk is more than just a, he's not a gimmick, he's actually a integral part of your survival, I feel like. He will be very useful. Um, I'm excited because, like I said, this is my first actual real attempt 
to seriously play this and have a real playthrough. And I wanted to save that for you guys to see. Um, and as you can see, this world is very big. There's a lot going on here. Um, the orcs are slow moving. I, uh, I've had a little rock'em sock'em with an orc or two, but do not let that fool you. They are There are a lot of them. Uh, and they are not fun, so... Eventually, I need to figure out some shelter, but uh, I think I'd like to build along this river here, so that way I can keep I'm grabbing all the damn gold I can right now, guys. Um, so that I can fish when I make a fishing rod, so that I can, um, you know, capitalize on that, or Gronk work as my garter of crops, and that will be what I do. Um, there are dead trees around the water, there actually are, I, I'm just not seeing them right now because I'm not near them. Oh, first on camera, I sneezed on camera. <laughs> I'm not editing that out, it's fine. Um, and if you wonder why I don't do all these flashy jump cuts or any of that, it's, it's actually one of the reasons, and I've said it before, we wanted to do a Let's Play channel, and a channel where we had fun, where we didn't feel like we were catering to people and talking down to them, or acting fake or dumb. We wanted to do a channel of Let's Plays where it felt like the reactions were genuine, because they are genuine. Um, I've had a few games that I was not thrilled with that just didn't even make it to Let's Plays, I'll be honest. Uh, um, there was one I was going to do a Let's Play of that I didn't because of the fact that uh, it was dead. There was just nobody, no one even on it. Um, there's been another one I have not done a Let's Play of for other such reasons, but enough about that. Right now we're worried about this game, which uh, I am enjoying so far. A little worried because I'm not accomplishing as much as I would like, um, and that is my fault. I tend to wander a lot in games. And I, I take too long exploring and looking around, and that I'm hoping is not going to be the death of me here. You can make uh, some weapons, you can make lots of other things. I'm grabbing all the gold I can preemptively because I know I'm going to need it. So before nightfall, before I can't see it anymore, I'm trying to get it. Um, but we have at least collected our Gronk. We got Gronk up and moving. And I feel, again, like I said, I, I, Gronk is going to be useful. There are a lot of little areas out here that are flat, the land is, and I feel like I need to figure out where the hell I'm going to build a shelter. Um, and also, am I going to build into the ground? Am I going to build above ground? I just need something so that the orcs can knock off and leave me alone. Gronk! No, don't! Don't do that! Clearly Gronk is a champion swimmer. He's a little dude. I feel like if he was like just maybe like a foot shorter, I could just put him in my pocket. Um, Alright, Gronk. So, what else do we need for us to check? Uh, what do I need for this here? This is a hot key. So we have bedrock, I need five, I need a flint. I have more than enough dead trees, so we're gonna... We're gonna get to the making here. So this is how this works, guys. Is we, we set this stuff down. I want to make some extra bedrock though, because if I remember right, something else needs bedrock. I get a bit of fun with it. Um, and we're going to make some flint. Hopefully not die as we're doing all this, but if we do, then maximum effort, guys, maximum effort. Okay, so, voila, we have a fire down now with make. Um, I need iron. So we are going to be doing at least 10 iron, so that is one. Two, three, four, five,
Okay. Uh, and bedrock. I need as much bedrock as I can. And the reason is because, like I said, we're going from this to making... Uh, that fire has a purpose, by the way. That fire is very useful. Um, and when I do all this stuff, you guys will see what I'm doing here. But the, uh, the fire now. Okay, so we, we uh, got some stuff here. Building, farming, doing all the things. Okay, need to knock that shit off. Alright, so inventory. Inventory here. We have iron ore. Um, now. Uh, trying to remember what the heck I was doing here. It's been a very long day, guys. Um, you can see all the different minerals, too. I just want to point this out. There's a lot of stuff you can make in this game. Uh, some materials here, right? So we're going to turn this iron ore into some iron. So, uh, voila bing. Just like that. Yes, yes. And, uh, alright. So I believe that is, uh, what I needed. Now. Um, you're gonna go to building, you're gonna go to work tools, and you're gonna go toward cooking pot. We are gonna set down our cooking pot. And if we left click, uh, oh shit, on the cooking pot, we need to go to harvest. My bad here. So, inventory, harvest. Um, let's click on something here. Boom! Oh no! I should not have done that there. That was not a smart thing that I did. Oh god, I can't believe I just did that. Okay, I should have I should have fed ground since you first. Um Oh I cannot believe I did that. That was a dumb, dumb, dumb thing I did. Okay. Alright, we're not doing that twice now, guys. Okay. Um, and again, that's my fault, actually. Um, so, you get some veggies here. And if you notice, uh, down there in the left corner, my health meter is going up. So first step is to feed me. After I feed me, then I worry about feeding Gronk. And after we feed Gronk, then Gronk uh, becomes an even more valuable asset because then Gronk can worry about guarding our stuff for us. And once I get Gronk to start guarding stuff, then I can start making our home. Um, and again, I'm not that worried about a super fancy home right now. I just need this stuff working. You know what I'm saying? I need it going. Um, bless the creator of this game for letting us get a little creative with some of the things that we're using. Um, this is going to be down to the friggin' wire, I feel like. Oh boy. We're trying, folks, we're trying. Do we dare? Yeah, we do. That'll be me with one bamboo. Oh my god, look at how close we are. Come on, baby. Alright, well, anyways, now it is certainly time to use our fertilizer and uh, start ourselves on the farm here because this is where we're going to be living. I decided that right off the bat. And uh, we have definitely gotten a much better start 
Um, two things we need to protect today, first of all. Right off the bat, I'll say it. Uh, we have got to protect this farm, but we also really need to protect that fire pot. I don't want that fire pot going out, because I think that's going to be horribly detrimental to us. Um, and I need to get fed fully, so that way I can get an extra super drunk to feed him, and then give him the command to guard this. Because with him guarding this, and all I gotta worry about is guarding one thing and not two. So, first of all here, let's uh, worry about that. You will hear a loud cat behind you, I apologize. Um, that is uh, our cat who is very, very mouthy. Um, always is, but you know, he's a cat. Yes, we hear you, buddy. He is, he is internet famous. I wonder if we can get him up here, maybe. Uh, would you guys like to see the cat? Let's see if we can get him. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's gonna come up. Alright, come on. Come on. There we are, ladies and gentlemen. The cat. Alright, so, we have a cat joining us on our adventure now. Um, and as you see, it takes a little bit here. Um, I do believe now, if I am right, that you can actually help these grow a little quicker. I think I hit the wrong soil. The wrong thing here. You can keep kind of spreading on some fertilizer. I'm helping some of these crops progress. But uh, I'm feeling pretty good about this, guys. I think by nightfall we are going to have a gronk guarding our crops. And uh, you got to admit, though, you know, the game has quite a bit of charm to it here. I'm, I'm, I'm really digging it. And like I said, do not underestimate this menu. Look at this. Farming. Um, you can put down all sorts of stuff. Um, the fertilizer... As you see here, lets you pick the kind of grass you want down there. So, um, I like this. It's traditional. But see down the road, right? You guys can make different kinds of wood if you want floor for your home. Uh, let's actually take a quick look while we're waiting for our crops and see what some of these things require. So, okay, so we need palm board. Palm planks, raw hardwood. So we can start off there by getting some stuff from a tree, having raw wood, and you know, keep redefining it. Um, so that is kind of cool, actually. I, I do dig that. Um, Gronk is over here anxiously awaiting our crops at the my. Um, let's uh, let's go back here to the fertilizer stuff and. Uh, how long should we wait, guys, do you think? Should we should we take a stab at him right now? Um, I don't know. See, look at all these little shit chickens just waiting across the lake. Is that chicken swimming? Look at, look at this. Oh no, that is not a chicken swimming. I am losing my damn mind today. That was not a chicken swimming. And I think the fire has developed. Well, the fire is still good. Okay. Um, so, we're getting some stuff. Oh, shit. I know there is a crap, but I don't to get it. Um, so, yeah. A little preemptive here. I'm getting desperate with this stuff. So, let's see what we got to work with, shall we? Um, Alright, we got. One more. Not quite enough yet. Not quite enough yet. I was really... Uh, I was banking too much on this here, guys. Um, but well, we're getting there. We're going to see. So let's see what else we can do here. What I'm trying to do, if you have noticed, is keep a rotation. For example, I want to keep 
uh, inventory of all of the things that we have so we do not run out. Um, but instead, so that we can continually uh, keep that going. So there, now I can make a, another soup. Um, it is getting slightly hard to know uh, exactly what I should be doing here. Um, not in the game, mind you. The game is actually quite, quite, uh, quite easy when it comes to this stuff. Um, I actually am very impressed with how uh, fast you can sort of, like you just saw there, I just repaired that uh, without much of a problem. And Gronk has decided he is tired as shit and he is not putting up with the snow god. Darkness is rising, everybody. Now that noise you hear, um, if I remember right, those are orcs. Now, another feature I want to talk about, guys, is the orcs you can turn on and off. Um, orcs are assholes, so they will start coming out of nowhere here. There they go. Little son of a bitch. And he will start trying to mess with me. No, I'm not trying to plant a crop, son. I'm trying to... Uh, inventory, harvest... Tomato. I have got to fix all this stuff right now by attacking these things. I'm going to so I recommend you strafe and click. Strafe and click. Oh god, what did I do? Okay, that, that was dumb on me. Are they off fighting Gronk? How did Gronk go? No, Gronk is there, okay. Please don't die on me, Gronk. You're my only friend, Gronk. Okay, so. That was some crazy shit. We are trying to get up enough crap here. So that I do not have to worry about it, and I can finally get ground sass on this, and I think we can do this. I think we can do this. It's hard, man. It's hard. Alright. I hear them. I don't see them, but... Um, in the daytime, they leave again. So, they are kind of like a... I really need to knock that shit off. Um, in the daytime, they leave again. So, they are a end-all, be-all thing. And again, uh, I do want to point out here that that is certainly not the... Uh, designer's fault that is me being a dope and not paying uh, good attention to the controls um, because the orc is uh, messing with me and I keep looking for the orcs. They're over there, but they look like they're... No, they're headed this way. It's out now. I'm going to go ahead and move. The orcs are... Slow and dumb, but they do have a lot of hit points, and they can do you are going to be a trust me. Right, as you can see there, this one I do not want to be I'm trying to avoid them from being able to break my shit, so I'm trying to avoid them. I'm trying to stop them from breaking my shit. So, again, a little challenge with this game here. Um, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to fertilize one whole more section of ground and really get these crops jumping. Because I feel like this is what I need to do to increase stuff. Um, 
Come the daytime, if I can survive this first night, I feel like I'm gonna be in a good place because I can use all this. Yeah. You can turn your orcs off, by the way, and just have this like the island survival thing with Rome and just try to see how you do it. Also, by the way, it's very cool. The developer put a lot of love in this game. And again, can we just all have a moment of appreciation for the fact that we have, oh, I don't know, other options instead of just bringing zombies? I love that, personally. Thank you, Dad. Oh, I'm so sick. 90,000 zombie sims and, you know, knowing that this is something different. Cool shit, definitely. Right off the bat, it's good. So, some tips that I've got these guys. Keep the orcs busy. Keep them away from your shit. They just wreck things like throw the party buildings. They don't care what they mess with. Oh god. Also, strafe. Strafe, strafe, strafe. Strafe. You can see our hearts aren't great for the first night, but we're gonna try to get crops going like crazy. I feel like the sun is starting to come up a little bit. Uh, the sun will come out. Okay. So what we're going to do here is invest this little real estate patch here um, in every bit of this that we have done. We are going to try and keep these puppies growing. Keep keep the crafts going until finally all of these are a row of each kind and I feel like if I can get that going I'll be good to go. Poor little Gronk there is probably hungry as shit. Sorry Gronk, buddy I'm doing the best I can. Try to look out here. We are on the we are on the war path right now. We're not on the war path but we are at war with things. Um, funny thing here by the way guys we ended up getting a uh, an Amazon Dot, or Amazon Echo Dot, uh, is a gift from my family, which was pretty cool. Uh, so we've been having a little fun with that, having it tell us jokes and stuff. Uh, little PSA, though, I did not know about, though, that I do feel like I should tell you guys, because I did not know this, and... Uh, it's. I feel like it's useful for anybody out there who loves music, and that is that they do not play music on your computer. You have to sign up for a service, so if you're getting it for that reason, um, just be aware of that. I was not aware of that. Um, I mean, I'm not complaining. We got them as a gift, so I really can't, you know, what am I going to do? Complain about a gift I got? Uh, now those crows over there will also yank your seeds up if you're not careful. So Gronk is doubly important for this sort of thing. Uh, and I don't know what's growing here, and I don't know how long to have this stuff grow. Because I feel like I really need to... Okay. So that's two yielding for one. That's three yielding for one, so... And that has given me two extra. See where we're at here with tomatoes. See, so we're on to something with my theory here. Alright. And as we do this, we're gonna slowly just kind of like one set of patches at a time here expand our garden. I don't want to go too huge, but I do want enough so that by nightfall we can really hammer out and just eat a ton of soup and then get Gronk going at the same time here. So we got two tomato, 
two, three bamboo, uh, and you only need four of something for a seed. So that's pretty reasonable, I'd say. Uh, so right now we're at a decent, decent craft yield here. We got enough for one seed there. And we're starting to see some plus to the corn yield. So there's a little rhythm with this game, guys. Let's check our bamboo. Okay, now as you can see here, um, there is a little bit of give and take, and that is that the Jesus get the hell out of me. Um, that the longer uh, it takes us, I'm not trying to plant them, you silly. The longer it takes us to do this stuff, the uh, the worse off we are with the fire. But again, I can't really complain because you know uh, what the hell we're gonna do. Let's do one more whole line here. Here we go. Rick James said that once. <laughs> See what I did there? Incorrigible, I tell you, I am. Okay. Uh, so we have ourselves a little craft growing. Gronk has not uh, been much help yet, but again, I can understand why. Who the hell are we? We haven't fed him yet, so why is he gonna help us? So. We are going to really hedge our bets today that we can guard this today and tonight. Uh, tomorrow, I think that's that's our time. Uh, but as you can see, it's not that this is a hard game to really um, figure out how to survive in. It's just a consistent game. you got to keep at it for your survival. My crown can get, get out of there, son. The friggin' clown is playing around in there. And I think this is where I am doing the correct thing and getting a huge uh, yield off this stuff is, uh, you know, keep a keep a big enough section to do. But you see how many tomatoes I got now. So even if we repurpose and plant these. We're still going to end up starting with a lot more than we have lost, and that's what I was hoping for here. Obviously, the longer you let these grow, the better our, uh, the fruits of our labor are, so... Um, I'm not really going to lie here, I think the bamboo is my least favorite crop so far. Uh, I mean, it's not that they're not, you know, fruitful. They, they, they do what they do, but uh, out of all of them so far, I believe that tomato has been the most worth it. So let's go back over here. I oh, know the fire is out. How do we start the fire? It's a good question. Um, I'm not quite sure about that, actually. Um, uh, okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to rebuild this here. Now, I may not have to, actually. I don't know. Um, oh my god. I can feed Gronk right now. What the hell? Alright. Inventory. Uh, what am I doing here? Make Gronk feed Gronk soup. Oh. Yeah, baby. Alright, Gronk. My man. My Gronk. Guard. I want you to guard this. So I need to get Gronk some more soup, then I can do this. Alright. Uh, well, still, that's pretty uh, pretty cool there that I finally got to feed Gronk. Um, and we are starting to do pretty decent with our crops here. They're they're coming in, so this is uh this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna hit, uh, and again I apologize, guys. You can probably hear my crazy ass cat in the background again. Um, I need bedrock, so I need to find gold, but I don't want to leave this area. Oh, Gronk, don't fail me now, buddy. 
We certainly have more than enough crap. You had one effing job, Grunk. One effing job. Okay, so I feed him once, and then after I feed him again with the seeps, he will start listening. Um. God. I have five bedrock. I just need five more. Do I have enough to make bedrock? Do I have enough? I do not. And I am very reluctant to head down anywhere to find it. But, uh, oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to do, guys. Quite a dilemma. Quite a dilemma. Um, getting some good yield on my crops here. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to grab all my crops. Literally all of them. Everything I can grab. If the, if the chickens eat some of this, they're gonna eat some of it, but I'm not that worried because we have grabbed so much of it now that we will certainly be able to make some soup for breakfast. No little shit will be happening there. And then we're gonna go find some of that back. Put this stuff out. Uh, get Gronk to guard this. And there, you know, maybe make a, uh, maybe make a home, I'll see. Now, in case you're wondering why I'm picking up the ground as well, there's a reason, and the reason is so that I know I can see it from farther away and see it, but, and I know it sounds silly, but, uh, I, I, that's how I roll a little bit, and I like to know where I'm at, I like to know where I've been, so that's what we're doing. So we got a little ground following us. Uh, you can hear him running around on his little stumpy feet. Uh, he is slightly adorable, not gonna lie. Um, and again, if you guys want to take a chance on a decent game, I'm sure you guys have played more than enough Tripway titles. Um, you know my channel features things that are hidden gems a lot. This is certainly a hidden gem. Um, I have been quite impressed with this little game here. Look at that. We found um, I mean, it's got digging, it's got farming, it's got, uh, base building. You can come around the hills here, grab every little piece of this you see. Fully destructible environment. Um, and like I said, you know, one of the coolest things to me, no zombies for a change. Which is amazing. I mean, let me show you one other fun, fun little thing here that I get a kick out of. Um, the chickens. Yeah, you better run. They drop feathers, um, and you can use them to fly. So, very cool feature. Something, something different to change in a survival game. But this is whole survival game. But it's very different, and like I said, a lot of love put into it. A lot of love put into it. Um, I barely even scratched the surface of what you can do in this game. Um, again, Merry Christmas to everybody out there. I uh, hope you guys are enjoying your day. We certainly are, around here. Um, I'm going to call it here. Um, but yes, Orc Island. If you guys have not had a great chance to check this game out, you can see some practice islands I have made here. We're actually going to call this. Um, uh, we're going to name this after Grunk. So we're going to call it Grunk is awesome. And hit save and save this here. And uh, anyways, so make sure you guys uh, check this game out, click it in the link, um, and you guys have a great holidays, subscribe, follow, oh, oh Gronk is livid, <laughs> smacking the shit out of the chickens, I swear he just laughed, that was amazing, alright, so yes, <laughs> make sure to subscribe, uh, make sure to give us a like, make sure to tell your friends about our channel, I have been Bones, thank you guys very much for watching Orc Island, uh, you guys have a great day.